Hey guys, your boy Maester here, and welcome to my first episode of my whole city career mode, guys. It is the first FIFA 17 video on my channel as well, so um, I, I'm pretty excited about this series because I want to do this whole city career mode from day one since obviously the new um, EPL season started. Because they are currently the underdogs of this series, in my opinion, because of their um, not because of lack of ability, but because of lack of players in the team. Because obviously the numbers were very few in the beginning. They signed a couple of players, but still that is not enough, in my opinion. Um, if players do get in touch with it, don't. But if they do get injured, they don't have many players to replace them. Many good players to replace them in some sense, um, which is one sad thing to hear about. Don't know why. Don't know really what's happening behind the scenes. I'm really following Hull City as much because they won in the EPL last year. They came from the Championship. They got promoted. Uh, but obviously they have done well and they are a good team because they have been in the BPL before. Or the, or it was the BPL before. Um, and they have been in it for quite a few years. I, I'm, that's, to be honest with you, football wasn't the sport I used to follow a long time before. Uh, I wasn't following it as much. Uh, but recently I have, maybe four or five years to be honest, before I wasn't really into it. But now I enjoy uh, watching the football, following the football and all that stuff. But anyway, so uh, FIFA this year has done some changes into Karema, which I do enjoy. But... Um, they should have done a slightly bit better but anyway so as you guys can see here this is the new features that they've brought in the new uh, kind of objectives part of this team so there's financials there's brand endorsements or brand exposure sorry um, and all that stuff which is which weren't there before uh, but is now and it kind of tells you what you have to do and you have to achieve it for your success or for your rating as i've said i'm 80 right now and if i don't achieve that my rating will go lower or i might even lose the job of being uh, of being the manager of the team so as you guys see, the financial there was pretty high, 85%, uh, 85 million, sorry, of, uh, and to generate that much profit by the end of the season, which is quite a lot, to be honest with you. Uh, but is the BPL, is the EPL, sorry, so you're most likely to achieve that if by saying shirts or whatever, if you, but you have to finish in the high end of the table to do that, to be honest with you. We're aiming to end, uh, to, to finish around um, mid-table, which is still optimistic in, in my opinion, and to finish in around 16th of the FA Cup, which is also pretty good. It's not optimistic, I say optimistic, it's not optimistic, it's achievable in some sense. Um, hopefully that will be pretty good. And all that stuff. Uh, brand exposure, they saw so I it 10 million or something like that to sell off shirts, which is actually pretty good to be honest. The EPL, if the team does really well, they are gonna sell their shirts, and they will definitely sell those shirts pretty easily, with no worries at all. Um, so uh, the thing is currently, as you guys can see, the gameplay wise is, it's pretty much different. It is very the mechanics have changed slightly, but it is the change. Those changes are still effective, and they can affect the players' play. So for the time being, I'm currently playing a professional difficulty, um, and I want to get used to the mechanics first and see how the game works and the gameplay and all that stuff. So for me to be able to play the EPO when I want to start playing the league games, I am at my best, and I know what difficulty I can play at and what my uh, limit is basically. So. Currently, I'm playing professional. Professional seems okay right now. Um, I'm able to play around with a bit. Uh, obviously, defensively, I'm still doing poor, but um, attacking well, I'm slightly getting. I'm able to use our replays more easily and obviously move the ball around a bit more better. Uh, I'm thinking of going world class, but that will all depend how I perform throughout this preseason tournament. And once I, the thing is, I'm going to stay professional till the end of the preseason tournament. That's my mistake I'm going to do. Uh, wherever, wherever I finish, I'm staying professional till then. And once I leave the, uh, once we start the EPL, um, I will decide whether to either increase my difficulty to move to world class, or either leave it as is to professional, which that will all depend on how I perform in the preseason tournament. To be honest with you, um, so to be honest with you, I, this game is a very the, the, the FIFA 17 is a very good game as a gameplay, but. Content wise, I don't think there isn't much of a change. FIFA 17 could have done slightly better in the sense of because the current mode is one of the ga game modes which is played the is played the most in, in my opinion. Ultimate Team is played, but FIFA uh, the current mode is played a lot in some countries where internet isn't as uh, how do you say it, isn't as high speed or isn't as good as uh, some countries. They will play career mode as a career mode. If they do enjoy the game, if they enjoy FIFA, they will play this kind of career mode. And career mode will be played more likely around the world than Ultimate Team, to be honest with you, in my opinion. Uh, but anyway, so uh, 
So I feel like they should have done more instead. They bought the brand and all that kind of stuff, but they should have done more. They bought the journey, but I thought that would be uh, not just that'd be like a my player thing kind of thing. I thought I didn't know it was gonna be a separate whole content. Even though they have improved, they are doing good. But I thought I'd be like more like a uh, like a my player thing or a player career mode kind of thing, where you play as a, any player, any career mode, whatever team you choose, whatever thing it goes to, you're able to do it and you're able to go through that kind of project. It still works anyhow. So I thought I'll be kind of that kind of way, but then it didn't happen like that, but still that's fine. That is good, because NBA you're allowed to change your player, you can change your features of the player, doesn't really matter who the player is, you can change it how you like. Uh, and still in the end, you'll still go for the same storyline and that kind of stuff, which I would have appreciated slightly more if they were able to do that, but still FIFA is doing a lot more than they did uh, before, to be honest with you. For the career mode side, or journey side, or whatever. Um, so currently in FIFA I'm doing pretty well attacking wise I'm able to attack and um, finish the chances that I get somehow in the end um, but defensively I'm doing pretty poor uh, defensively I don't know what, I, what I'm doing what I'm doing wrong or right I do not know but I something's not right for me uh, I try my best right now to attack and defend uh, it's kind of the same level but I'm not able to do that purely because of me being unable uh, to keep up with the players when attack is it once I attack my line will come forward with me a bit my defensive line will come up and if they counter attack they pass the ball backwards uh, they, they, they pass the ball and my defense is high and the players with them on that line my players will easily be overtaken because of pace if the player has pace um, it'll be pretty easily overtaken which is kind of realistic but it's annoying because we haven't seen that on FIFA's so um, I still need to get used to that in some sense but hopefully that will change as I play more games and more uh, gameplay of this game um, this is our first attack here Mela um, gives the ball to Embakani Embakani finishes it to the bottom record after turning the defender there um, it's a pretty good finish to be honest because he turned around the player held the ball for like a couple of seconds he held the ball there and then turned around and then has a shot there to the far corner making it 1-0 is a pretty good start for this game guys 11 minutes into the game and we made it 1-0 and Ember Carney has seemed like a really good player for this team guys to be honest with you I know he's a good player in real life but for this series he might be a really key player for us to get those profits and all those pieces and all that stuff to take place for us to make it happen he will be a key player because I believe so if the shirts are the 10 million I think he will be a key player in selling those shirts if we perform well for this series um, I'm hoping to do this for more than one season hopefully depending on how it does I'm trying to, I'm trying to get another career mode I'm trying to do a latent, career, latent orient career mode as I support latent orient um, I want to do their career mode and I kind of be like a road to glory and trying to get them to, div uh, to the Premier League um, in the however, see how many seasons it takes to get done and all that stuff so hopefully I'll be trying I'll be trying to do that in some sense trying to get that done uh, hopefully soon I, want, I, want, I may do it after the uh, the January uh, transfer window for this series com uh, comes to and then I will do that uh, do the later in Karema the road to glory for that and hopefully that will be a good series for you guys to watch hopefully that will be pretty soon hopefully if I'm able to upload this every two days uh, that will come pretty soon to be honest with you guys and hopefully that will come by up by the end of October, hopefully November, hopefully mid, I think it'll be by November, it should be there, guaranteed, whatever happens. Um, so that would start, if you guys are interested, please subscribe and you guys will be notified the minute I upload that uh, later on Karim and you guys will know. I'm also going to do a Ultimate Team uh, Ultimate Team series where I'll be trying to uh, get to Division 1 and all that stuff, but you guys will know that it's, a pack, it's called Pack-A-Punch, it's a series where basically open... Uh, I can only use players from packs on that stuff. It is kind of been taken, uh, kind of been inspired by Zerka and Tobe Jizzle. So I mixed both of their series together. Taken the name of uh, Tobe Jizzle, um, of how his name was called Pack a Punch. But I've used the ideas of Zerka and made the series. Obviously, mine will be slightly different, not too different, it's just slightly different uh, in the sense of um, transfer market wise and that stuff. But um, hope, hopefully you guys will enjoy it because the content wise I hopefully will try and do that for you guys and hopefully you guys will enjoy that that stuff um, and that's also been recorded to be honest with you but I just haven't had the chance to edit it as I've been very very busy with my personal life and all that stuff um, 
but gameplay wise um with, for me to record i've been able to record it pretty easily and I, I can't record my voice at the same time sometimes i because um there's a lot of people in my house so causing me to record at the same time me to record my voice is very difficult i've got to find a time in the day where there's no one awake or there's no one in the house where i can speak at the same time and not be disturbed by noises around me it should be pretty fine but obviously that will uh, hopefully change pretty soon and uh, you guys will be able to uh, enjoy these videos and are able to get this more daily and consistently which is what I'm hoping to achieve um, from this FIFA because I haven't been able to do it for the previous FIFA but I want to do it for this FIFA where I can get daily or per day stuff for you guys and, um, and get that all done with you, done for you. So I hope you guys did enjoy the video, if you did please do leave a like. Uh, please do subscribe and I want to know uh, if people are watching these videos if they enjoy it please tell me tell me in the comments below uh, if you guys enjoy it. if you want me to do another series tell me I'll do that I'll do another series I'll do the stuff that you guys want me to do in the sense uh, of Karema or even Ultimate Team I will try my best to do those series if I can I will definitely try and um, just give me those ideas and I will definitely try just leave in the comments down below and uh, that will be pretty awesome but anyway guys hope you guys did enjoy the video if you did please do leave a like subscribe and um Peace.